today and giving us the opportunity for the Liberian people to hear from us and exactly to, for us to contribute our own quota to this process. We want to use this occasion to thank Equal, AU, the RCGL, EU, the international community, particularly the uh, United States of America, for helping to bring lasting peace to this country. The distinguished ladies and gentlemen, I will ask at this time that you give me the opportunity in recognition of our fallen heroes for us to stand for the movement of Stalin in absorbing all those that were killed murdered during the East Oakley Civil War from 1822 up to 1990. Can we please stand? Shall we stand? And I please allow me to use my balikinos because I want to pray. And a few words. Can I, Mr. Commissioner? You <laughs> I want to quickly turn this in my vernacular, uh, you know, in English. We are saying that in recognition of those foreign heroes from 1822 up to now, we recognize them. We recognize the fact that. This country, when the America Liberian came, plantation slaves, they met people on the soil. But because of their own personal greed, they have frontier forces, land seizure, deciding killing our people. When Duke and other recognized that, they had told our people not to sell land to them. Those that did not listen later on, they resolved to war. And the war started from that point up to side star war and up to even 19 the rise riot before 1983 1985 invasion and 1989 december 24th you know war and this time we want our lord to bless this country as we all sit here we should not come here with with just uh, a white teeth and black hat pretending and the commissioners here god should bless them and whatsoever they want to do here, it should be free of partisanship, of capitalism, terrorism, and whatsoever you will do, you are doing it, and the Lagrange people are looking up to you. May God bless you. Thank you very much. Uh, again, in continuation, uh, Mr. Commission, we thank you very much for inviting us here at this point in time after several decades of war for us to come here for the Liberian people to listen to us to hear our side based on allegations levied against us and politically contribute our quota to the ongoing process before the TRC. We thank you and the Lord will spread in your hand and whatsoever you are doing here it should be on the basis of fair, fair play justice love and put the country friends because tomorrow anything you do here prosperity will judge you if it is right or wrong i will say this um, i have a reservation and protest which i want to use this occasion to <coughs> present to you after <coughs> my delivery after speaking we believe that there are four important ethnic groups key player in the civil war. Crown people are not the aggressor. We are the aggrieved. And the war that came, invasion, 
war, revolution, so called by killer, the American Liberian, slash plantation slaves, both their children and what have you, sponsor and finance the war. As we speak, I see John Honorable Stewart and Honorable Gerald Coleman from the American stock. I also see other Honorable Dolope. I also see you. I also see Madame Pierre Boo from the O Order. And I see uh, Oman Sila, who also supposed to be well off from where, but the Madingo and brother Che Kavuma Kone. The point is amazing. At the end of the day, whatsoever you do here will be banning on the crown people. But whether you like it or not, we have to defend ourselves. We have to be the one to seek our own interest. In Nigeria, as we are aware, we got a lot of insincere, devilish, uncouth and unkind citizens. Anything that concerns crown, they see it as very bad. But yesterday, when everybody was in open air and in slavery, the vision 2024 of Taylor, that particular tyrannical government, nobody dared to stand. Men were around here wearing panting. Jane Strain, fine Jane Strain. We came in to liberate this country. The liberation today that was set the stage for you to be here, set the stage for the democratic disposition. And we believe that you are doing things, do it honorably and sincerely. I don't know why your state was used. I am the framework of the, comfort, comfort, uh, of the peace accord, comprehensive peace accord in Accra. Being the framework, we said the intent and spirit of the STRC is to bring everybody together in order for us to come and add our differences. What is happening to Crown and none of them here? If you talk about vetting, we said vetting. The vetting those committee that's supposed to occur on the voting process happen to be the United States government, the UN, ECWAS. EU, AU, RCGL. And I believe we are qualified enough to be ready for a crown man to sit on a table with you. You, I think the World Letter Council of Wister Tumblr mentioned the same thing. Tomorrow, will you say, if you come out with a belly and we do not have that covenant and refuse to honor it, can, we, can you hold on to that? The question, the answer is no. I have taken the issue up with Your Excellency that wrote her after the appointment of the commission. Up to now, there's no result. No response. Nothing. And I feel indeed constrained as one of the eminent leaders of the, of the crown people to use this public hearing, this opportunity to raise this, not only raise it, but to indeed send in the protest. And the protest cabinet are going to come to you, the, the president, EU, ECOWAS, the International Committee, AU, ECOWAS, ERCGL, the speaker, uh, the pro tem, chief justice, and all important officials in society. We do not want tomorrow, if we do not respect you, respect this body that we have created, we will not make it our business to come here. We gave you the honor and we respect you and we respect this body that what we came. But grand men, we are not the other people that play deceit. We don't keep things on mind. We don't play games. We are focused, we are frank, and we are sincere. I believe that's the reason we don't like us. So any bad thing, as you say down here, grand men moving people for it. They are not even thinking about anything. Rebel kind of grand jury. What grand jury, grand jury, for what? With our excellency as president, we set the stage, I was speaker, you asked the, the election commission, uh, Madam Morris, we worked together to formulate the laws that today produce the young democracy. Why is it said that, you say that grand jury, people because security people want to eat money, and crown people to low ugly. We are now for war. Crown men only resist, protect themselves if you bring war. And we never brought war in this country. 
all the world that can tell the history from 1983 it was Queen Yomba and group 1985 was the same Queen Yomba and the Bureau people and the American Liberian all of them and others to near King and others that you go out that year the budget they brought the war from Africans uh, and Burkina Faso and we see yet to say that yeah, I know you will invite Kwanu you will invite uh, Jerry Rowling and you will invite uh, uh, Tunia King and uh, Clarence Thompson them, the ACDL people that collect money and all to finance the war. I know you're going to do that. We are here to be frank with you. If we are not seated between men, between you and myself, I'm going to be frank with you. Anything that you want to tomorrow, history that you are writing, and like great people looking up to you, will not be part of it. You can write it. The book on here, whatsoever, five continue on history, whatsoever, from the Green Leaf Constitution that honor that indeed excluded the Aboriginal of this country until 1980. When Sawyer, as actually of the Constitution, came, uh, though, appointed them and uh, canceled the revised and what have you today, and we are all, we're talking about equal opportunity and what have you today. If we, the same thing will happen to us, that you will sit down and we will not be a part of it after the war upon wars. That against the crown people, we take serious section. And having said this, I want to use this occasion to give your man the document, protest to you, to the commission, to be looked into now before we proceed with this with this with this process. Thank you very much. Just one more question. You said to be looked into now before we proceed. What exactly do you mean? Yeah, I just say because uh, I said utterly. If you have a protest sent to you as honorable member sitting down, you have to reach out, look into it and tell me. I just said, gave you a protest that I want crown representation on the TROC commission and on the secretary. Let me tell you one thing I got a document you sent to me. When a letter was sent to me telling me and uh, rating me on June 6, George, the way you are here by by invite, you are here by invited to, to, to APA. As senior executive member of APFL, can George Dwight be senior executive member of LPFL? When you did not say you, you limbo LPC or any organization, and you cannot stop it. Yeah. Honor the law constitutionally, no man is convicted. It is a ledge until that person is taken to a carpenter court or jurisdiction. You send a letter and say, not linked, you are linked to human rights abuses. And therefore, come the commission want to know which they say link you. I have my counselor, he wrote you back. I send a letter here to you. That under the law, I'm not I'm not indicted, I'm not convicted until it is proven. So if you sitting here with all these concerns, then what happened to all ordinary crown people that will be appearing before you? Now I heard you over radio yesterday, VOA that George Bully have appeared on several occasions. But George Bia is not the George Bully, if there's anything, he through diplomatic means will be brought before you. The that when George Bully turned uh, turn away with them, uh Tony came there. The the the, the, the AB Tomo White that married to Blaze Kapari, Blaze Kapari then, or uh, 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 Jerry Rowling, that finance the war, Libya President Gaddafi. You have the uh, ability to bring them here? Do you have? Will you bring them? Will you bring one who that killed Doe when we are, uh, 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 they must stop. Johnson was standing here at Grand Doe to ISIS. Will you bring 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 that that that, that Blaze Kapari then? That be fair. That of that lady will not recognize you if one man is not sitting here. I came to make you to know that we know you, the Liberian people, very well. Liberian people are the chicken. They eat your food and drag their mouth on the ground. All what we did, our brothers and sisters that died in the process to have the political dispensation today, nobody recognized that. Crime and Madigo, they don't know that. Nobody collected money when they were here, they wouldn't lose up. So when jungle they were here, they were beating them. So then they were punching them, as they were saying. Some of you are forced to fall 
for four soldiers of star, the progressive, and soya them, y'all know that. They sit here right here. Soya them and he, here to be making a lot of money, using the government, doing all sorts of things. They talk about democracy. We have democracy now. So I, we have to defend ourselves. Okay, we we are now moving to the substance of your presentation. Am yeah, I honest? Wait, wait now, just a minute. Am I understanding you to say that until a crown person is seated here, you will not I make it? I want to even give me a Just a minute, just yeah. a minute, please. Yeah, yeah. Am I understanding you to say yeah. that until a crown person is seated here, you will not make your presentation? I am saying, and I stand to say it again, until this person is looked into, a crown people, crown may join you for the issue of security and protection. Which you address this protest first. Well, let me just let me just say this. Please, can you give it to your You question? spoke, you spoke in substance yeah. to what you term to be your protest, and the first response would be one: we didn't constitute ourselves as a commission. No. Two. You rightly said that you were one of those who were the architect of the yeah. CPA. Yeah. And I'm convinced you were in the country when the TRC Act was presented to the legislature. Yeah. That was since 2005. Yeah. And under the TRC Act, they have standards for qualification to be on the commission, mm. and they have a selection panel, like you rightly said, that did this selection. There were requirements in terms of regional balance and all of that. Yeah. There was no ethnic. No regional. Yes. There was no ethnic requirement yeah. that all ethnicity or all tribes should be represented on the commission. Okay. I'm sure and I'm convinced yeah. that if there was an ethnic yeah. requirement for, the, for, for membership to the TRLC, yeah. all of these commissioners would not have accepted to, to serve because we do not believe ethnicity yeah. is a standard for reconciliation and peace in Liberia. Yeah. We feel ethnicity has been part of the problems and our country should rise above ethnicity. Yeah. So as you have come, we have welcomed you. Like you say, you wrote a communication in response to that June 6. Okay, we heard, but I'm sure the Secretariat responded and you could resolve the differences that were there. Never resolved them. Well, if that's not the case, I'm sure you, your, current, your presence here is in response to an updated communication, I guess, because I heard about it. I didn't read the communication and I said you were wrong for misnaming or misidentifying Honorable George Dewey because he has not served the NPFL and the lawyer was right. And then a subsequent communication should be written to clarify that. Okay. I, I, think didn't, I didn't receive it. Maybe they wrote to your lawyer. Since the lawyer wrote, I'm sure they responded to the lawyer. On the other question of the interview, I'm sure it's taken out of context because I didn't specifically speak to George, I mean to Honorable George Bully. There was a general question about what will happen to people who are outside of Liberia and need to come. I said, well, if the TRC gets to that point, there are available diplomatic and political means to ensure that people come if it is necessary. So since you have come in response to the invitation of the commission, and you have rightly said you have respect for this body, we can only say, if you submit that document to us, we will receive it. But there shouldn't be any precondition to your appearance and presentation or whatever you have to say to the commission. If you hold that precondition, it means that you are not prepared for today's hearings, and we may just close it down and you go your way. Uh, if you have a document to be presented to us, we will receive it, as you have presented to the hearing officer, I will direct that he brings it now and give it to the commissioners. And I think the response that I have given is sufficient to answer the question of ethnicity. If you still feel strongly that you don't want to talk to the commission because a crime person is not seated here, I think it will be unfortunate and then we'll have to close down. You you well, inquiry? Huh? Inquiry. Yes, please. My inquiry to you, Mr. Chairman, is here. you are saying for your own act that regional balance. Okay? Your regional balance that you're talking about. You have a uh, honorable Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. I, I, I think I have the flow. Yes, you do. But I just wanted to say, let's not reduce this into an no, argument. I'm not. I'm happy to I need to be protected by you. So let me learn. Can you take the flow, Mr. Chairman? 
Yeah, but what I'm saying. And on the floor, Mr. Chairman, you said regional balance. Just a minute. I didn't say there's an act. Or from Grand Union County. Let me try. Who is here from Grand Union County? Who is here from the South East? This is what I'm saying. We are not here to defend the composition of the TRC. If you do, because we didn't do that. If you do a proper check, you will know that there are people represented here from the South East. I'm not going to point them out. It was not my responsibility to select commissioners. I didn't select myself. We were selected based upon a process. We were cited to interviews, we start the interviews, and finally out of more than 189 persons, they selected the eight for the nine of us. Thank you. Mr. Okay. Chairman, what I'd like for us to do, that's the same problem we got in this country. You sitting here today, we are talking about peace. And the peace, we should not want a peace that later on, your effort for it to be in vain. You remember that we reached out to Mont as well, Leonard Man came here and raised the same issue? We stepped up and raised it to you? Very well, and we responded in similar manner as okay. we are responding today. And I just want to say that if one feel, if you people feel that uh, we could go ahead, honor the protest, I'll give you the protest which I'll give to everyone, everybody. Honor protest will go ahead to submit, to go ahead with our, our, our submission. But we want to tell you clearly that tomorrow, if you want to use this to indeed in the half crown people or other people that are key players in that debt, we vehemently we want to resist that. We will reject it because we know that everybody in this country are against us for nothing because of greed and jealousy. So if you want us to go ahead only to satisfy your witch. And the document here, here in, will not be looked into. I will give it to you, we'll go ahead with my submission. But I just want to rest up clearly and use this video for the international community as well as I'm to know that tomorrow, if there is anything that, uh, that will be bounded, that you accept to be on the crown people or Brazilian or other people, we take serious exception. As Mr. I said, Wiggins. when you look at your new position, you look at the, 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 the mm -hmm. element. Just a minute. We, just a minute. We, 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 we know how many people vote for NEMA. We talk about geographical balance. We know how many people for the America that grows stock that's sitting here. We know those that are from United Party that are here. Mr. Witness. So we are saying we raise them for this for the Mr. international Witness. community to know. Mr. That Witness. That whatsoever that is there under the sleeve of this of this Mr. Party, Witness. Quote unquote, your 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 the uh, remotely control. Mr. That is Witness. There. We want, we want to tell you that we are aware. Mr. Witness. Thank you, yeah. Let me just see. Okay, the choice is yours at this moment to make your presentation or not. Okay. All that I said yeah. is that you have a document. Uh, uh, Mr. Bodia, Mr. Mm. Bodia, Chairman, the choice is mine. I have the right to walk away. If you feel that you will use the TRC that will create it, to use it as a springboard, don't you plan to, to intimidate us? Yeah, but this I can leave. Yeah, no, Nothing you can do. No, we but are I'm just telling you that I have, I have a, a genuine protest. We understand what you are saying. If we receive the protest and we discuss it, then we move ahead. No. But if you want to say, move if you No, 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 no. No, no, no. We know already that you we have just, just You have just presented. Already you have just. You have just presented. You have just presented your protest. Like I said, the hearing officer will give it to commissioners. Okay, and your protest is not a subject. Your protest is not the subject of our being here, and we cannot go into it because. Thank you. Feel that way, we hear that. You won't talk to me. Mr. Yeah. Can. My cousin talk to me. You want to say something? Listen to me. I think I'm. I. First, we want to thank you for taking off your time to come before the commission. This tends to suggest that you have respect for the commission. And we want to also thank you for not keeping anything in your mind. Expressing your reservation 
and put it into writing to give it to us. But I want you to answer a few questions for me. If a man and a woman enter into a relationship without marrying, woman, man and woman? Yeah. <laughs> without marrying. They got plenty of money like Rose and not married. Where? And the child so is born. <laughs> and the child is born. Yeah. <clears throat> Who will take the blame for bastard it? Who will take the blame? Yeah. If the woman and the man yeah. enter the relationship yeah. without marriage. Yeah. Who will take the blame? Yeah. For the both the For the child being a bastard. And they came to you mean and they and they, and they have a child. Yeah. Firstly, the issue like the question, the the both of them. The father and, and, the the mother, and the mother. They are responsible. Yeah. Now if someone do you something yeah. And instead of you jumped on that person, yeah. you jump on the saddle, how people look at you to be? Come back. If I do something to you, yeah. and I'm standing, uh -huh. instead of coming to me directly, you jump on my shadow, on my picture on the ground, yeah. how people will look at you? That question, the issue for which I brought this, that you two are the one that's sitting, no, I'm well, saying this. So I, I don't just, know your shadow. What you got to do with what we are saying? Okay. Now, if you answer the question, I will tell you what I'm. No, I don't know that say. question. You answer yourself. All right. You said in your testimony, yeah, in your presentation of the protest, yeah. that you are one of the free months of the Accra Peace Accord. Granted. It is this peace accord, yeah, that envisage the necessary need of yeah. establishing TRC. Yeah. You were speaker of the Honorable House of Representatives yeah. when the act of the TRC was passed into law. No point of correction. Yeah. Before it passed into law, yeah. I was not there. You were no longer speaker. No, I was not okay. there. I was suspended when that happened. But you were state member. No, I didn't. I decided not to go back as member. I said I was not taking because what happened was kangaroo. Okay. And uh, there were no due process. I was not there. Okay. In view of that, the question you asked just now uh, uh, of, of, uh, that you're talking about, what we, if we have the means and the ability, that when I say I wrote, Her uh, Excellency, I have not gotten any redress after your appointment. And also, I am using this medium to bring this protest so that the Liberian people will know. And if we give it to you, you know, the first thing that what I like, maybe when you are young and you are head of the group, then the way you look at it. If somebody have, if I have it and kept it, and start putting people in the street crime post, start demonstrating, or graduate start demonstrating without being represented, they will say we are confusion, we are confusionist. It is good to bring it to you. It is your responsibility to take our protest to whatsoever, respond to us, we are receiving. Either you reach you not reach and say, hey, this issue is X, Y, Z. But for the sake of so so so, we, but you are telling me you bring it. If this is not a so so of that, then you have to so so. So that means that whatsoever what I said automatically, uh, or you put it was calculated, wrongfully planned to have whatsoever you wanted to execute. Because we are seeing our interest. Because I am our we said regional balance. We did not even say the tenure to say from 1979 to two, to 19 to 2003. We never. What we wanted was to start for 1822. The thing that happened to our people in this country up to two, up to 1980 that led to the coup, it was not just the, the coup, the rest right, was not, was very insignificant. When our brother and sister, were, when our sister that were raised taxes and what have you, uh, people were sent to Fernando Po, uh, sexually people were abused by three-week party and what have you. Why should we sit down and say it should start? So we never even agreed to that, to that. 1979 to 19 or 2003. We also protested. Quiet. Okay. So what I try to say is that <clears throat> we are an offspring of the Accra Peace Accord, <clears throat> excuse me, and that of the act that put in place the TRC. And 
It was done as far back as 2005. It was never Ellen Johnson Sully that appointed us as commissioners. She came into office and met us already appointed. Now, you as a legislature, you as a politician, you as an influential person, the opportunity existed at the time the act was passed into law and printed into handbill for you to raise the issue to the legislature that created it. And also for you to find a motion or a, a letter to uh, Charles Bryant when he was chairman of the transitional government. We have been seated up to this time. Now you are raising the issue with us. But I'm happy that you have said if we accept your document and say that you should give your statement, you will do so. I will advise you as your senior person to do so. Because the matter you are present here, we feel is in good fit. And your presence here avails you the opportunity of making certain clarification. That many people used to say you 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 were a member of AFL, you were recruited and you are a soldier. Now you have made that clarification that no, you were never. But point of, point of inquiry, point of inquiry. Yeah. As we now speaking today, do you have on the next radio station currently, or we are doing it in camera? No. What? When, when you talk about in camera, we can't come to public like this. It's not camera in camera. Means, okay, if it is not live, mm. is it live? Yeah, if it in camera, we we'll to our office. Oh man, camera, you can go in the in section mm. and you feel that uh, it should not go out with press and you discuss in executive. So if this is like say it's camera. Yeah, this is a public hearing. A public, public hearing, yeah. is it live or not? Mr. Witness. Is that part of? Huh? Is that part of why? I don't understand where that comes from. Where that coming from? Uh -huh. I feel that every other witnesses that came here been live, and I want to know I'm, I'm if it is live or if it is not live. I want to know if they're not the why. I feel okay. that so you are giving them. They got the same segregation. Mr. Witness. I beg your indulgence. Oh, but then I think the whole thing I if you say I should leave Mr. Now, Witness. No, if we didn't. Me leave, Mr. Witness. No, 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 no. No, we're not saying you should leave. Uh, let me be frank with you. Mr. Witness. Mr. Honorable Chairman, I'm on the floor. Just a minute. Asking. Yes, just a minute, please. Just a minute, please. Let's handle issue by issue. The first okay. issue. No, listen. If you get to the point where you want you are prepared to testify despite your protest. And then you make an inquiry as to whether it is live or not, that is a different issue. Okay. But where we are now, you presented a protest and you say you want a crime person here before you testify. And I was saying, well, we don't have control over that. We cannot question our own constitution. And so we cannot guarantee you that this body will find a crime person to sit here before you make your testimony, okay? But however, this is where we are. You have presented the documents. We receive the documents. We instruct the hearing officer to bring the documents. We receive it, and we should proceed. That was our advice to you. Thank you. After you were, uh, Mr. Chairman, after speaking, I believe the well could your well learned colleague, took the floor, and he made some parable. And after the parable, he said something, and I said clearly, in fact, and let me tell you, Mr. Chairman, the only person I fell on earth that God, not in moment. Uh, if I want to tell you this, I tell you. If I don't want to, I don't tell you it. If I don't want to sit here, I pack my satchel and I leave. I have come for the Lagrange like, Court to know what I stand for. Allegations that were made against me to redeem my character over radio. And I came and asked you a question, which I call constitutionally I'm entitled to. And I cannot apologize 
of telling you what I said on my protest, I'm entitled to them. That my right, constitutional right, will not ask you to apologize to, for and that. And I give it to you, enable you to accept it or you leave it. And what I said is to me to inform you that four tribes are the key players in the civil war. The American Liberian slash plantation slaves and their children, the, the Madingos, the Gio Mana and the Crown. Pull it in your own shield. Let it be a battle of Bazolian sitting down with all these problems. And tomorrow you're talking about a three uh, representative. And your interest is not protected. You will come here and start clapping and dancing because the theater before the commission. I have the right to tell you what I feel. So you have the right to equally tell me how we proceed. And I, I have been a speaker. I know how to conduct proceeding. If somebody has a rest of or protest or reservation, brought in, receive it, I don't look it. Or what you do? I don't resolve, you know, whatsoever and come back and say, oh, uh, we got it or we'll send it to the community room, we'll do that. We say, do not and go so, so, so. You are not here because you chairman to tell me what to do. I have a protest. Let us dispose of it. You were talking. Dispose of it, fine. Let us move, up, move forward. Take it. He brings it to you. You receive it. We come for their oneness. So that what we all want to do, whether we get you no business, we don't get you no business, we, we you are making uh, shop business law. Okay. But now I think we are dealing with that. Okay. I, I when think. I sit down, say, what do I yes, receive it. Thank you. With this, we feel that as we are doing, we did not appoint ourselves. But send you how CC happened to go to so 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 people. We will get together as community member of commission to make sure to see how best we do. And therefore, say you are here. If I don't respect you, I'll come. If I don't create you, I'm one of the, the three ones. That is, that is sufficient, we understand. Proud to come before you. Let's make no matter shut up. But I expect you to tell me, Let's you know, make as a gentleman to respond to me too, so that we can proceed. We, so the issue is that the next issue is, if I will be here to have a discussion, just a minute. With, with that being like, these are some of the things, so just, you take it and let's see what we can do. We have Mr. still time, we have to move. Mr. Yerry, please bring a document.